Well, it's kind of an ode to the king of pop from a DJ super fan in Southwest One, Montana. Two, three. Dear Michael Jackson, I want to be starting something original by writing you this letter. I'm not trying to claim to be the biggest know-it-all about your life or claim to be the biggest fan. But what I am trying to share is how greatly you have positively impacted my life. The way you make me feel with your music is almost inexplicable. It makes me feel like I want to get on the floor. It gives me butterflies. It makes me feel like a dancing machine. I believe music is therapeutic. Whether it's an earth song or a jam, it can heal souls and it can heal the world. Michael, we've had the chance to be with you and your music career since your childhood. Starting with your ABCs, you rock the world with your talents and the world still wants to rock with you today. One of the first songs of yours I really connected with was Will You Be There? It was on the Free Willy soundtrack and the Dangerous album, two of my favorite cassette tapes in the early 90s. I would hold a handful of pens and markers as my microphone and dance in my room and belt the track at the top of my lungs. It was a very moving song, so I naturally had to play it pretty loud. My mom would bust in my room demanding that I turn the music down, just like in the intro of Black or White when Macaulay Culkin's character just wants to jam. The videos you've made reinvented the music scene and music television. Epic, ghoulish zombie tales, amazing morphing faces, sights from around the world and dance moves that would blow anyone away. The emotion, the passion, and talent that you pack into each tune and every album dubs you the king of pop. A title no one else is near deserving, and a title that will lay to rest with you. When I look back and remember the time of when you were accused of being dangerous and a bad, smooth criminal, it makes me sad. It makes me just want to say, hey, just beat it. When you must have been thinking, why you want to trip on me? Haters will always hate. But when you look at the man in the mirror, just know that you're not alone. You have a strong base of friends, families, and fans that say you are my life. And I'll be there for you, Michael, just as you have been there for millions. Now that you're gone, people will say, I want you back. People thought you were invincible and that heaven can wait. Some can never say goodbye. Others scream in disbelief, but I guess it was time. Michael, your style and personality will forever be remembered. You always had to be living life off the wall and that's why I love you, MJ. Ask any old Billie Jean or Dirty Diana and they'll agree, there has never been a PYT like Michael Jackson. You have laid the way for fashion and style in American pop culture. We thank you for your contribution. You rock my world, Michael. You are the one and the only thriller. We miss you and will continue to love and cherish your life's work. Michael, don't stop till you get enough. With the utmost respect and love, Missy O'Malley.